Honey, do we have any other apron besides this one? Honey? Hi there, and welcome to Cooking with John. Today we're going to- Who are you talking to? Honey, I'm recording a video right now. A cooking show. I'm gonna be a YouTube star. Hi there everyone, and welcome to Cooking with John. Today, we're gonna learn how to make some homemade pancakes. So sit back, relax, and get ready to fill your mouth full of cake. Okay everyone, so we're gonna start off with some buttermilk and rye flour. I like to mix the two together because I find that you, I find that you get more of a soft, yeah, yet a firm sort of feel to it. Oh, sorry, let me try that one again. I like to, I like to mix the two together because I feel that it gives the pancakes a bit of a soft feel, but also still firm. I don't think I'm gonna be able to open this for real. Oh, honey. Now that we have our flowers in, we're gonna dump in a little bit of white milk and one brown egg. I make this recipe quite often and one thing I would suggest is, before you start cooking, you better go to the bathroom. Because every single time I am about to cook, I always have to be. Back to our mixture. So you want to get in there nice and deep. Okay? And you want the batter to be a bit firm so it can still cling together, yet you want it liquid enough so that it can slip through your fingers. Did you wash your hands? <sighs> all right, now that we've done all of that mixing, we're about ready to cook. So, being a vegan, I always use coconut oil to oil up my pans. Uh, you can use whichever oil you'd like, that's up to you. Um, but once you put the oil in your pan, take a nice big glob of batter and dump it in. Okay? And smooth it out a bit so that the pancake is nice and round. Okay? And we'll turn our burner up to medium high. Okay, so let's let that cook for a little while and I know what you're all thinking out there right now. You're saying, hey, my pancakes are almost done. What should I put on top of them? Good question. So, what I like to do is, I like to slather a good bit of yellow butter on top of them, and then after that, I'll drizzle some nice organic honey. I find that it blends that fatty taste with something sweet. And not to forget any of you health nuts out there, I've also got some cut fruit. And this fruit I use is a yellow golden kiwi. Now, most people say that yellow golden kiwis aren't very good for putting onto pancakes, but I beg to differ. What's that smell? Oh, So that's our fruit toppings. Why don't we take our attention back to our pancakes now. So, to flip your pancake, all you wanna do is, is get nice and underneath it, and just give it a little flip. And you only need to leave the pancake on the other side for just a few moments. Then you're ready to plate. All right. Well, there you have it, everyone. Homemade pancakes. If you enjoyed the recipe and liked the video, then please click the subscribe button below. Thanks for watching, 
and we'll see you next time. How can you not smell that? Did you burn it on purpose? Why would I do it on purpose? You know I can't smell anything. <laughs>